President Tsai Ing-wen rallied party members at the DPP's National Party Congress on Sunday in preparation for the year-end municipal elections. With all the DPP's candidates on the stage, the audience chanted slogans, generating a buzz for the polls that are seen as a midterm assessment of the ruling DPP's performance. Tsai, who is the party's chair, said the DPP learned its lesson the hard way in the 2018 elections. This time, she said, it was fully prepared. The 2018 local elections were a hard lesson for the DPP. This time around, we have made the most thorough preparations, produced the best political achievements and put forth the strongest candidates so that we can gain the greatest support from the people. We can now present a report card which has the quality assurance of DPP governance. If the DPP wins, Taiwan will definitely win. If you don't win, President Tsai will have a hard time continuing down her path. The government must protect Taiwan, take care of the people and move towards the world. In 2018, the DPP was thrashed, dropping from having 13 mayors and county commissioners to just six. Premier Su took to the stage and listed the Thai administration's achievements. He also produced opinion poll results showing that the president's approval rating has reached close to 48 percent, a near 20 percentage point increase from 2018's 28.5 percent. He added that the DPP's support had gone up by eight percentage points, while the KMT's had fallen by 22.